With a comb beam technology, we have the ability to place dental implants in our patients uh, with much more accuracy and precision. So for example, I have patients in my practice who um, maybe they have a unique situation, a limited amount of bone, um, a very little room for error when it comes to the surgical procedure. A comb beam allows us to accurately place that restoration um, as quickly and efficiently as possible, um, but at the same time, eliminating uh, the need for maybe more complex surgeries um, and faster healing and turnaround time for the patient as well. I had a gentleman walk into my office uh, who was uh, 90 years old and uh, he had been missing all his teeth and been wearing false teeth, which we, we call as dentures. Uh, he'd been wearing dentures for over 40 years of his life and he had been told by um, several dentists that he could never get uh, dental implants. And uh, when he walked into my office, I was able to use the, the dental cone beam CT technology to actually study the anatomy of his jaws while I, and while I recognize the challenges which was presented to him by other doctors, but using this new technology, I was able to clearly identify what, this, what the problem was, where the nerves were, what anatomic structures were of a hindrance, and I was able to predictably place implants on, on this patient and provide him with an improved implant-related prosthesis, and, uh, he was, and he basically was able to enjoy foods which he had not enjoyed in over 40 years of his life. Implants is a big um, revolution that has been here for a long time, but now us being able to um, give a one day care to a patient and providing that care and be very precise with that utilizing the technology, uh, it's really something that I can, I mean, I can just, I love working that way. I mean, patients come in, they have their surgery, they can have uh, teeth that same day and that's really, really exciting for a patient um, and also exciting for us being able to provide this service utilizing the technology. was a beautiful model that we had done her veneers. Uh, she came into the office, she had an accident, she got hit in the mouth at a taxi, driving to the taxi going to work. So she had a broke, her beautiful smile was broken, she had a shoot at six o'clock. It was three in the afternoon and she walks in and she says, Dr. Dean, what am I gonna do? I said, don't worry, I have this technology. In two hours, you're gonna get a perfect front tooth that matches all the other veneers that you had in less than two hours. And when she walked out, she just couldn't believe it. Just couldn't believe that we actually reconstructed the exact same tooth, the exact same color. And especially, you can imagine, the front tooth is the most sightly area when somebody smiles. So we matched it perfectly. Digital dentistry is the workflow. There is no step from planning the surgery, doing the surgery, planning and making the abutments, 
planning and making the final restorations that is not digital. So many of our patients have never had any experience with having an impression or waiting for the laboratory to finish a procedure two or three weeks. Most of our procedures are finished the same day or the next day. And this gives a patient, uh, you know, tremendous comfort. My mentor was uh, Dr. Victor Lucia, and we had spent a weekend in Toronto when uh, implants were first introduced to the American continent by Dr. Brown and Mark. So I come back and I'm sitting in his office and he says to me, I said to him, you know, Dr. Lucia, it seems like everything that's ever needed to be invented is invented now. I said, what do we, what do we have now? We have implants, we can do anything. And he just looked back at me and said, you have no idea what's coming. So when you fast forward that to where we are today, it's an amazing time to be a prosthodontist. I have been uh, at active duty for the past seven years. The past three of it, I have been practicing as a prosthodontist. I was trained by the Army to be a prosthodontist. And as a result, I feel like I have the best ability to provide our soldiers uh, with the most advanced treatment options when it comes to CAD CAM dentistry. We have the ability to give a patient a tooth in a day so that our soldiers are ready to deploy uh, at the drop of a hat. What's really amazing in the journey that I've had in prosthodontics is that in the beginning it was all about periodontal disease and how that related to teeth. Here we are at a completely new voyage. We now have digital dentistry which is allowing us to take patients who never before could be restored to health and we're able to use digital technology to devise, plan, and formulate everything that a patient needs to get back to great aesthetics, great function. It is a change in paradigm. As a prosthodontist, my patients are really excited about this whole process. They like to see, once our scan has been done, their tooth enlarged to a you know, really uh, large level so that they can see the little details that go into designing their new restoration. Not only can we do you know, single tooth units at this point, we can do bridges for patients. So it goes from you know, just being able to do single teeth within a session. Now, within a few hours, my patient can come in, I can prep, I can scan, 
and then also mill out a prosthesis for them that they can go home wearing that same day. So it's really changing the way people look at dentistry. I think it makes it more accessible and less unpleasant. Guided surgery is taking the 3D radiographic information and from that planning the implant surgical therapy starting with the prostheses first. So we're actually looking at the outcome first and then we're strategically placing dental implants to support that prosthesis. That's a great way of doing it because ultimately this is all prosthetically driven care. We want the teeth in the right spot so they function and look really, really well. The biggest advantage that I see for patients is I have a crown that's all ceramic. It's beautiful. It looks exactly like a tooth, um, better than their tooth looks now. It's not gold or titanium or amalgam. It's gorgeous and no one even knows that the tooth has been restored when we're done seating that crown. So it's full function, super strong, and super pretty. And that's very exciting for patients.